Hey guys, and welcome back to Let's Play Synodots. And as you can see, we have a landed medium here. Probably building another base. Let's just hope he doesn't. But anyway, let's um, assault this base right here. Corsair Interceptor. The X-37 Corsair is the first aircraft designed specifically for fighting extraterrestrial craft. We have made extensive use of alien materials when designing the airframe and used materials known to be resistant to alien weapons for everything else. Producing an aircraft that is faster, tougher, and le no less agile than our F-17 Condor interceptors. It is not capable of carrying heavy torpedoes, so should complement the Foxtrot rather than replacing it. In many respects, the design of the craft is revolutionary rather than is evolutionary rather than revolutionary. It's an immense undertaking to design an entire aircraft in such a short time, even for someone as intelligent as myself. Many of the gains have been made by reproducing existing systems using more efficient alien materials and manufacturing techniques. But we have made two main innovations: introduction of a a variable sweep wing design and the new ER-3 Alenium Impulsion Reactor Turbine System. The latter produced twice as much thrust as a conventional jet turbine, the former increasing maneuverability at low speed while also increasing performance at high speeds. As a result, the Corsair can cruise at almost 3000 km per hour despite the extra armor making, making it larger and heavier than its predecessor. Construction of East Corsair represents a significant investment of time, money, and alien materials. But I have little doubt that conventional aircraft will rapidly become obsolete as the invasion escalates further. Yeah, we might actually have to uh, start build them pretty soon. Let's get this um, officer interrogated as well. Corsair. Uh, oh crap. That was not good. Oh well. Alien officer interrogation. The average alien soldier is just an empty shell, possessing an instinctive knowledge of the craft of war, but little higher brain function. There is a reason for this. Alien officers are high, highly intelligent, and do not lead their troops in battle so much as directly possess them. I would suggest that the word officer is a misnomer. Controller would be more appropriate. The alien mindset is strange. We were already aware the same species and rank were identical clones, but it seems that these creatures actually consider themselves interchangeable. Not exactly a collective consciousness, more than they simply have no concept, concept of self. Provided one of the clones survives, they would not consider themselves to be dead. This makes interrogation a struggle. Not only is it difficult to threaten a creature which cannot grasp the concept of its own death, Choosing the correct pronoun when asking a question becomes a minefield. Nonetheless, we managed to glean a little useful information. The captain confirmed the intention of the invasion was to kill the humans individually, but not collectively. It seems they are not actually trying to wipe us out. In truth, this is nothing we didn't already know. If the aliens want to annihilate us, they could simply have bombed us into extinction from orbit. The invasion evidently has a higher purpose, but we could not extract it from our captive. We left to capture an alien leader to learn more. Okay, and where will we find a leader? Uh, UFO 55. Uh, can we intercept him with... No, cannot. Okay, fine. Alien base. Let's do this. <laughs> Civilian. Well, at least no mind controls or stuff like that. Deployment Xenomorph, Mefatu, Linkso, Pufudi, and myself. And whoa, it's one of these. And hopefully, 
this won't become a massacre. Hello, anyone at home? Nope, of course not. Actually, you go up here. Five, that's me. Should go down here, abandon here. Just go somewhere. Captain K. Sartorus and Greg Draco. Battle Bunny. Horse CM. How far can you get? Not far at all. And Private CK Hawk. Running around with his trusty sniper rifle. Or sniper laser. I do have a feeling that we will open this door and be like, oh crap. Because there's like 600 aliens waiting for us. And if that is the case, then... Mefato, you will have the permission to uh, fire those rockets at anything. It is a bit quiet though. I don't know how I like that. Knock, knock, knocking on an alien door. Anyone at home? Let's open and see. Hello. One there. And one there. Okay, fine. Ring so. Kill the thing. Nice. Cinemorph. Nice, nice. Oh well, that was a little bit too aggressive, I think. Captain K. Actually, my father, you follow Captain K. Soft dress. Get down here. CK Hawk. Go into hiding. Oh! Hello and welcome to Alien. No! That wasn't very nice. Anyone gonna move? So, who did we lose? Pew Foodie. Okay. Battle Bunny. Kill the thing. And. Hmm. Are you dead or not? Yes, you are. And you're using a... Conventional weapons? Why would you be doing that? I have no idea. Major Mefatu, running like the wind. Major Lingso joins up with Xenomorph. And I get the feeling there's... I don't really like the look of this room. And don't get me wrong, I 
like the look of the room, but I don't like the look of the room because I don't want to go in there. Oh, you are so screwed. Someone did reaction fire. Who wants a hug? No one? Okay, fine. How much? Ten. Kill this thing. Thank you. Uh, horse CM and Greg Draco. Sinorf. I require a headshot. And you delivered. And for that, I thank you. How about me? Oh, so close. That's even closer. Uh, Battle Bunny, keep moving up. Linkso, Bandoneer, moves up. Oh, you are that smart, okay. Good. Okay, so who's next? No one. I demand satisfaction. What the hell are you carrying? Whatever it is, it's big and it's probably capable of killing us. 29% chance to hit. I count that as a hit. 11% chance. Well, 11 is better than nothing. Xenomorph. That's not a hit. Okay, whatever that weapon is, it's big. Ugly and probably a bit too powerful. Oh, snap. This isn't too good. Just keep running up this hallway here. Shit. Oh. You got to be the worst shot ever. And Captain K is dead. And he got revenged right away. Ouch. Painful. Come on, guys. Link so. Not that bad wound, actually. No, no, don't shoot. Seriously. Okay, so uh, Battle Bunny, kill the thing. No, not gonna move you. Uh, 
my father is gonna keep an watch on that door. I would like to know what kind of weapon you have. Damn you! Whatever it is, it does a hell of a lot of damage. Okay, so get over here. Hit him. Hit him. No, of course not. Why would you hit him? That's just silly, isn't it? And one. Greg Draco, we need you and Horse CM down here. Hello. And there goes the shield. Perfect. Just what I wanted. Just what I wanted. Okay, let's move into some cover. Kneel down and shoot this thing. And you actually did. And there's more. Of course there's more. <laughs> oh. Don't like this. Keep running. If I move you over here. Nice. Number two, that's my father. Battle Bunny. CK Hawk. You're gonna have some real fun in this room down here because I suspect the layout is the same as the other. Nice. One more time. No? Okay, fine. Okay. Hello. No one at home. Okay, so 24% chance. Nice, 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 nice. How about now? Okay, let's just get you back there. And hopefully, this isn't a too bad of a decision. That's a miss. That's a devastating hit. It's bleeding. Oh, fudge. Okay, so kill this thing. Sinorf, heal yourself. Much better. 
And let's see. There's one. Can I kill it? No, because there's... How much do I need? 20 for a single shot. That's not good. Okay, so... Uh, hello! Ouch. Okay! Battle Bunny. Hmm. 14, actually. Get you over here. And get you guys over here. Where are you? There. How much? I get 20. Which means I get 8. Nope, let's not risk it. Nice reactions. Really nice reactions. Software has demonstrated that you don't need a shield to kill stuff. Pistol is um, more than enough. Okay, Zeno, get your gun out. Blow this place up. Abandon here. And there's one, okay. 77% chance to hit, and you killed him. Perfect. Battle Bunny. That's not a hit. Just so you know. Keep on moving up, guys. I think we... Oh, what? No? What? Excuse me. And that's it from this area, I guess. Well, let's uh, continue our killing somewhere else then. And there should only be one area left. And that will be the... Uh, Control room. Oh, hello. Oh. Didn't really want you to come there, but okay, fine. Oh, you little sneaky thing. Hello, Mr. Alien. Not really a fan of you sneaking up upon me like that. And for doing that, you will be um, punished with death. And Horse Gem and Great Drive are a little bit behind, but nothing too bad at the moment. And it seems like this video is dragging along onto 25 minutes, so I will have to stop it right here. And when we get back, 
the last room and the alien officer or leader. I can't decide. Anyway, until then, until then. Bye.